Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the another video. iOS 18 developer beta 5 is out for a while. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the performance, the battery life and how this is um, running. Also, I'm going to talk about when we can expect to see iOS 18 developer beta 6. Well, these are some of the topics that I'm going to cover in this video. And I'm going to start with the performance and for that I'm going to show you a Geekbench score of the iOS 18 developer beta 5. So for that, go to the Geekbench application over here. This is the latest score of the iOS 18 developer beta 5 as you can see. 2324 on a multi-core. Sorry, 2324 on a single core while 5622 on a multi-core. If I compare single core with the average iPhone 14, the scores are quite really good. It is better on iOS 18 developer beta 5 as you can see according to this. And if I go to the multi-core over here, it is again a much better score than the average iPhone 14. Now these scores are the sign that Apple is trying to bring stability. They are trying to improve the performance with every other version is releasing. Also, these are quite the best score. Talking about the multi-score score, it is the highest score I got from last couple of weeks. I am using iOS 18 developers and it is the best score as you can see. It is 5622 and in the previous version it was 5508, 5576, 5594, 5533 and even 5425 so this one is the best multi go score um, for the ios 18 developer beta 5 which is a really good sign of good performance and stability although these scores are not the exact thing okay the overall usage of device showcase the stability and since i'm using it from last couple of days ios 18 developer beta 5 i can assure you performance is really good i have no issue no lags nothing i haven't seen any bugs so far and everything is working really really fine although i want to talk about one single thing over here if i go to the calculator over here as you can see i type something like this plus or maybe something like this something this happened after tapping on the plus button e4 happened i don't know this is a bug or something happening i am not sure but that e4 came for somewhere and i don't know why it is happening but it is there if i try let's mean five sorry five plus five nothing happened a bigger figure nothing happened if i do that again for example multiply by 100 and okay again there, there is a e4 i don't know why it is happening but because it's not a it's not a that huge number it's a small number but still it is happening Maybe it is something a bug or something, but I am hoping that Apple will fix it. Well, now let's talk about the battery life. So going into settings, going into the battery section over here, let the battery stores last 10 days over here. Let's go to this day over here. As you can see clearly, I used my phone for around 75% according to this graph. And I got screen on time of six hours, 23 minutes. The used applications are TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, Safari, and some other applications if i go to some other day over here as you can see i have almost touched the 75 percent so i'm considering it 75 percent and over here it is eight hours four minutes which is insanely good and over here these are some of the applications which i use instagram tiktok safari snapchat whatsapp netflix for a bit and as you can see battery life is quite decent on the developer beta 5 i am feeling it has better battery life than the developer beta 4 but you guys let me know how your device is performing in the comment section below also tell, let me know that what ios version you are using and what you are expecting to see um, in upcoming versions also the last thing i want to cover is the release date of the ios 18 developer beta 6 since apple was on a two week cycle but since we are very getting closer to the actual release of the ios 18 i believe apple may go to the uh, one week cycle which means that we can expect to see ios 18 developer beta 6 for around 12th of uh, august or maybe 13th of august but if apple goes with the two week cycle again then we can expect to see it on 19th of august but let's see well that's it from this video i hope you like this video if you did give this video a big thumbs up do like and share this video subscribe to my channel and i will see you in my next video i am also seeing that most of the people are watching the videos but not subscribing so guys 
please make sure to subscribe and i will catch you in my next video only that take care peace out